NBA prediction. Uh oh, NBA prediction. Lakers. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, Kobe. Oh, they, they're not in it. What? <laughs> I have to go with Miami. When you have the best player in the world, people underestimate. Like LeBron James is six nine, two hundred seventy, all muscle. People don't realize he's the best player in the world. Not the state, not the country, the world. So when you have that on your team, you, you can't go against it. So I think LeBron need more props. He's so good that people, they just expect so much. So it's like a blessing and a curse. But at the end of the day, I think the Spurs are the better team all around. But I think Miami have the best player, which is going to bring everybody else up. And they'll take it at the end of the day in Game 7. So you, you think it's going to go down to Game 7? I think it's definitely going to go down to Game 7. You know, the Spurs, they put up, they're in the championship. Who would have thought? They're going to put up a fight. It's going to go to Game 7. People are going to be like, oh, Miami's going to lose. And they're going to win for – LeBron's going to – he'll win this year. Then next year I think the Lakers will win. But then after that, LeBron going to win the Nets too. And where do you think Dwight Howard's going to go? The White's my boy. I can't, really, I can't say anything. I, I, I already know. I can't say anything. But – you know, he's, he's, a, he's a good guy. I'm making sure not to wink or anything right now. You see my face is froze right now. But look, if y'all want to hit me up, just hit me up on my Twitter, at Romeo Miller, my Instagram, at Romeo Miller, and my keeks. So keek me at It's Rome, baby. I think I may be the best keeker in the world.